Hello and welcome to another video of beginner series. Today we are going to discuss one more power query function list dot find text. So let's jump to power BI. Now let's uh, go to power query. So home tab transform data transform data. We open the power query. So let's create a blank query and try to use this so blank query so it's going to create empty query here right click on the empty query advanced editor once you see the advanced editor second last option now we need a list first of all and in that list we want to find out something so list dot find text how do i create a list angular bracket one comma two one comma two comma three comma four comma five comma six and it's saying find text let's say can we give a number we give a number and we say find one and it say yo so you see the error okay so advanced editor does this work still you don't see because the list is not text go to advanced editor now let's create the list text format And let's keep it small. So I got one. Now let's further experiment. Again, right click advanced editor. What happens if I make it one, two, and let I make it one, two, three. I'm not adding in the one there. So is it exact match or is it fine? So it is fine. Basically in whatever column you find it, it is going to give you that, okay? So now what could happen is, uh, if you want to return set of elements which contains that one, you can return that as a list. So if I apply on a column, that particular column would get returned. So I can get the list. So let's say I want, uh, let's see if we have some data here, text data, we created one this, okay. So we have this table where we have B. So let's try to create another um, list where we uh, see that, you know, whatever column contains B, uh, how many column we are going to get B is there at two places. So how many we are going to get? So let's create new source, blank query, right click on the blank query, advanced editor. Then we go to D1, let's say list dot find text. And we say D1 column one. That's how we give uh, a column as a list comma. We want to find out B. And we got two B's. Okay, there are two rows which contains B. So both the elements we are getting it here. So in this manner, you can try out list dot find text. So go ahead and try that out. Do let us know what else you want us to cover in this particular series. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.